Hey guys, uh, oh, let's just start like this. Hey, you sexy people out there, how you doing? I hope you're doing pretty goddamn good. I'm doing pretty good, damn good myself. Anyway, guys, uh, this video is about YouTube and all the shit. It's been really weird lately. Um, since now I'm not a partner anymore, it just seems like YouTube. Who, whoever whoever was partnered with YouTube now it's like it's not it's not working the same way that it worked when I was you know doing stuff anyway look I'll show you guys I'll show you guys this right so I'm currently at what people would see when they go to my channel so this is what people usually see when they go to my channel, they see that, right? So, here it says, I don't know, zoom in, like, can we zoom in? See, see that says four views. Oh, come on, blur. Fuck you. See, it says four views, and that one says one view. That one says 26 views, right? But when I go to the actual video, so let's just go to this video, pause it for a second. 15 views! Right? We'll go to this one. Right. Pause. 8 views! We'll go to this one, it says 26 on it. 30 views! So is it 26 views or is it 30 views, YouTube? Like, so... When people go to my, this is, when people go to, oh, hang on. So when people go to this, this here, they're going to see, oh, this has only had four views. This uh, guy, this one's only had one view. Like, this guy's not any good. How about YouTube? You help the little guys out more and fix this issue we have. Now, as for, um, there's this new icon that I've found. Wait, there it is. It's a little blurry. But there's this new icon here. And that says either up, you click on it. I'll click on it. It says upload a video or go live. New. And now that I, oh, my copyright strike, or whatever, my, str my, my strike that I got is now gone. So, I can go live again on YouTube. I don't even know why I, why I got banned um, from going live on YouTube. I can't even, they didn't, they didn't give me a, 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 a normal reason why. Um, the, so, if you go, I say, go to customize channel and... That little icon disappears. It just now the upload sign that just goes takes you to the page. There's no, there's no live thing here. The what was the other issue that I was having with YouTube? Oh, the other. Ugh. Ugh. So the other issue that I'm having with YouTube at the moment is. When I'm uploading a video, I, I, now, nowadays, I usually put it as private, and I, then I go in, and I, and I do all, fix up all the, you know, end, end, end notations, and, um, all that sort of stuff first, get all the tags ready, all that sort of stuff, and then I publish, but I'll publish it, and I'll go back into the page that, I'll go back to this page here, right? And say, for instance, this one was the last one I uploaded. Um, it took five minutes for that to show up, even on this page. Like, I published it, and then five minutes later, it was there. It wasn't there when I pressed publish, and it doesn't... It's like, it's like YouTube have gotten this thing where, like, it has to check every video you upload now. I mean, that's okay if that's the case. Like, YouTube is making sure that everything that people put up, like what Logan Paul did with the dead body, you know. But is it... 
it can't be a person doing it. It's got to be a machine. How do you... How does a machine know visually if something's got something that's against the TOS? I mean, I could, I can imagine if it's got swearing or something, you know, like my, I, I usually swear a lot, so, um, I'm sure that it, it picks up on swearing, but how does it pick up on visual stuff? Because, um, they okay, I, I'm, I'm not going to be dobbing myself in, but I've got two videos on YouTube that one's from a game where you, where you can, it's Grand Theft Auto online, and I went to the strip club, and I had two girls give me a lap dance, and they got their boobies out. Like, I did it on purpose to see what would happen, and it was copyrighted because of the music, right? But I don't think... I didn't see, and it's been up there for ages, and I don't care, I'm, I mean, I don't care if they take it down, like, it's, it was, it was done for a reason, the reason was, how far can you push YouTube, like, how far can you get away with things, like, so, like, I mean, if it gets taken down, it gets taken down, you know, against TOS. Now there's another video that I'm not going to not going to tell you which video it is, but I accidentally put a booby shot in it. And it's and it's really quick, like it's quick booby shot. And um I didn't know I didn't notice at the time when I was making the video that that happened. And I was like and it was like I think it was like six to eight months later and I was like oh it's probably not that old I'm not too sure but I was like oh maybe it is maybe it's like six months old um but I was like oh snap there's a booby I didn't even know that <laughs> so I'm not gonna say which video it is but there's boobies in my in my somewhere in my videos um <laughs> So, um, yeah, like, that was, that was, that was not intentional. The, the GTA 5 one was intentional. And uh, I just wanted to see how far I could push YouTube. And, I mean, that, whoa, actually, it's, that, vi that video that I'm talking about, the, the GTA 5 one, will be in my game gaming playlist so girls 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 and stunts gta online it starts off me at a strip club with two girls on my lap with their boobies out anyway guys um i did tell you guys that i am currently in the process of making an awesome video two videos have come out since i said that the other day but they aren't the videos i was talking about um the Thrill House Arcade 86 series was a video that I was working on, but that's not the video that I was implying. Um, I've got a script and everything for the video that I'm currently making, but it won't be out for another couple of weeks or so. Um, I'm st I still need to do some research. And let's just give you a little hint, okay? This video is going to look like a video that you would see in the 80s. Um, so it's going to look 80s, very 80s. And because I was born in the 80s, I like the 80s kind of realm, realm era <laughs> and uh yeah so let's get down to that hey guys go and follow me on those um 
those social medias up there, Twitter, SSBoy82, Instagram, Matthew underscore Rosewarn, that's double T. Um, and, uh, well, you all can, like, if you haven't yet, subscribe to my YouTube channel and my Facebook there as well. Also, you can go and visit my website, MatthewRosewarn.SimpleSite.com, um, which has all my, like, songs and stuff on there. And in, well, hopefully next week, I'll be recording my EP with Chris McGrath at McChris, uh, at Mc, uh, at Chris McGrath's studio, which he's very kindly let me use. So, I'm going to be starting on. And so that means I'm going to be making um, music videos for my songs as well. So, I'm thinking, um... Yeah, that's going to be awesome. So music videos coming your way. Original music videos coming your way real soon. Um, so I can't wait for that to happen. So, and it's going to be, um, the, the audio quality is going to be fucking amazing. But also, um, I'm going to ask um, Chris to put down a bass track for me. Um, and I'm also going to see if he's got a drum kit there, so I can put a drum, uh, 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 uh just a simple drum beat down, um, on the thing, and maybe some backing vocals as well. So, it might be a couple of months before a music video comes out, or any music, music you from the recording comes out. So, stay tuned. Um, there's some awesome stuff this year coming to my channel. Um, it's unfortunate that I'm not going to get paid for any of that. Because I'm no longer partnered with YouTube, which sucks. Um, it was, it's quite, I don't like, this is the thing. So, um, I was talking to Danny from Donovan Jones Adventures and um, I said to him, um, how's it, how's life living, uh, living with the partnership, being partner, partnered to, like with, and he informed me that he was no longer partnered as well with YouTube and I was like, but why, you're over 1,000 subscribers and he goes, but I didn't have 4,000 hours of views and I was like, oh, Fudge. So, the thing, this is the thing, right? So, I had the 4,000 hours of views. I just didn't have the subscribers. And I think that's fucking wrong for YouTube to do that. If you have a 1,000 subscribers, you should be able to partner. It should either be, do you have 4,000 hours of views? You can partner. Or... Do you have a thousand subscribers? And you can partner. Not both. Not both things. Not have 1,000 subscribers and 4,000 hours of views. That's just too hard for, especially an Australian YouTuber where we do not have the same access that Americans do with their channels. Um... So, and YouTube spaces and all sorts of other things. The, the problem is, America thinks about America and not anyone else. They don't think about the rest of the world. They don't think about, hey, Australia's got some really good talent over there. We should give them a try. Give them a go. Give it a go, you know? We always, we're always the last ones to get the good shit. Like, they, they get the movies first. They get the games first. You know, they get the fastest internet first. You know, all this crap. It's like, you, they, they, they have all the conventions, like the really good conventions. And only VidCon just came here last year, you know. 
should have been years ago that VidCon thought, hey, let's go to Australia. Anyway, um, it was weird because they the, fir the first place that they went to was Amsterdam. It's like, why? Oh, I know why you wanted to go to Amsterdam because you wanted weed and you wanted to be able to smoke and eat weed legally because that's what happens there. So I know why you went there first, but why didn't you come here first? We have, well, we, we don't have, weed's not legal, but Australia's way better than freaking Amsterdam. You know what to do, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, share, and I will see you guys in the next vlog, uh, which will probably be up in a couple of days, maybe, I don't know, I don't know what's going on yet. Uh, actually, I am getting a new computer table desk, so I'll probably vlog that. So, stay tuned for some stuff. And now, I'm going to... Bye. See ya. I'm gone. Bye. <laughs>